Konnichiwa YouTubers, this is Red Stock straight from Point Magoo, California. Today we're going to do a video review of Robots in Disguise Roll Bar. This is actually a repaint from G1 Swindle from the Combaticons. Let's take a look at the package. So as you can see, it's a combiner. Yeah, I like the uh, combiner. Okay. Uh, yeah, so there it is, Roll Bar. Really, really nondescript, plain packaging. But then it is a little Legends class figure. So you can see it forms Ruination, which is Bruticus back in the day. So they're all named different, but I'll refer to them to their proper names. 2001 Hasbro. Okay, so it comes with a couple of things, as you can see, the little gun over here. And let's just pop it out. Not the hardest transformation in the world. So as you can see, it comes with a gun, another big gun, and that they both snap on together so I'm just gonna put this dude right here all right and that little gun just snaps on right here kind of neat so one big gun and that's a motif from these things is that basically you get two guns a big gun and a small gun I don't know why this little thing needs a big gun but it is I like the paint apps over here I like the spray uh, nothing descript and the tires aren't you know 2001 they, they're no longer what do you call that um, rubber so that's hard plastic very nondescript you can tell ah, so basic no stickers nothing like that you got the Decepticon logo but it is what it is it's not bad looking so that mode right there not too bad let's see it's, eh, 7 out of 10 oh, I like the turret that turns other than that, rolls quite well. So, let's go ahead and transform him, which is relatively easy, mind you. Hmm. Yeah, pop up legs. This thing pops up, and there you go. Swindle slash roll bar, which is also a, what do you call that? An alternator. The head, really nondescript, and these are really awful. <laughs> I, I, and I just don't like how the can hold you can hold each gun individually in each hand if you want I just don't like this arm the arms is the joints right in the middle so it looks awkward oh man what a disappointing miss you know this guy he's just below average either which way you want it you want to see it he, nothing special about this guy okay well also you can combine the guns just like before Really 4 out of 10, nondescript, ugly, what can I say? Alright, for a size comparison, you can get him. This is a Legends class figure, so you can tell. He's about 3 inches. And let me put a little G.I. Joe here for a comparison, which is a lot more colored. Just as a size comparison, G.I. Joe towers over him. So it's just, just a little Legends class figure. And I'm going to put Megatron in the background just so you can see how a deluxe figure is just ooh, even huge. Alright, so not much there. Alright, YouTubers, that's all I got, and I catch y'all next time.